Yo, what's going on, guys? So this is the um, another match two for the uh, infinite energy Spencer build. My infinite energy Spencer build. Um, if you're new and you haven't seen the video, check the video where I actually explain the the build. This is just me showing the build. So, but if you don't understand the build and how it's played, this is just show show shows you how it's played the build. The video of all the build and explaining every single point of it, the deck and everything. Just check that specific video for that. Uh, just search on my channel, uh, Infinite Energy Spencer Bill, I'm sure you can find it. Um, now, so this is my two, right? So, one thing I like to do there, uh, you don't have to do that, but you can set, I just throw, like, some, um, creatures right at the start before they even open the first door where, where I have the lichers from my preset waiting. Uh, that's just something I do, just to, you know, slow the down already. You, one thing I also like to do sometimes is, um... I wait for them to open the door, and when when they are distracted with the liquors from my preset, that's when I start spawning uh, creatures and things behind them. Because they're so they're distracted in the front, and then they're also attacking from the back, so it makes it really tough for them. I'm um, also spawning here. Also, this deck I'm using a variation where I have the uh, the shield on the deck, so it's really you see this really helpful when you play against these like gens and everything. Is they just like crazy about destroying your cameras uh, it makes a big difference I would consider this the the most complete version of this build uh, the deck and everything because you can just deal with everything all kinds of players all kinds of jams you know the people that like to destroy cameras people that don't like to destroy cameras either way you always have the uh, a good a good way to win here with this deck and now uh, you see because I only have two mods I like to leave the the shield there on my hand the, the shield card just ready for when they start shooting my camera, I can just activate it really quickly. Or if I don't want to take any risk, like right there, I just I use the shield before actually getting them start shooting on me. Also, if I you know want to just roll my cards really quickly, I, I can do that as well, using the shield a little earlier. Then uh, you know, not not so much reactive, but more proactive. Uh, you see right there, spawning the infected zombies right on top of the exit because they're going to be standing there. So uh, I guess they're infected already, because uh, even if they go to the other no, the zone, at least they are getting infected and all that, which is going to eat their time away slowly. So you see right here, I have the shoot again, so I'm just waiting if I need it or not. Not using it right away. And uh, right here, I see the the only point key left. I can probably use the shoot here, and my it's my machine gun, because that gen is going to try. They have to come inside here, but that gen can try to hack my camera, so that's why I need the shoot. And I got some shots there, some new shots. They took the damage and just uh, rushed away, but it's fine. They took the damage, that's why it's important. And they lost some time there as well, without gaining any. So this is, this is on this build is usually the only way they're gonna go through the first stage is if they just rush like that. They take the damage, but they run anyway. That's usually the only way they, because they it takes kind of a bit too long for them to die, so they can they can afford to do that. Just take a lot of damage on the way to the objective and just rush back but that they can only do that on the first area because on the other areas they they have actually have to stand on the, the objective zone to complete the objective so it's the, they don't have that same kind of option uh area two and three is more about destroying the cameras uh their best strategy so that's when the shield that i told you about comes into play a lot uh because since they have to stay on that same uh zone you know, destroying the camera is the best defense because then, you, then the camera is destroyed. You cannot keep throwing shit at them. So, uh, also here, I'm also obviously always always using my um, EIS system. I think it's the thing. So, turning lights off, closing doors, so I can always have the uh, my energy, just the the essence essence of the infinite infinite, infinite energy, energy build that I uh, made. So this is something that can also because this build is very like offensive, you can get a lot of downs, especially when you combine the machine gun with the mobilizing rounds or the the uh, D field for that matter. But because they have a uh, probably a mixtape uh, Valerie with that spray gun, they can just keep healing constantly and getting people off the floor very quickly. Um, but that's fine. You see, it won't it still won't stop me because they still have to deal with the time. And uh, I can also focus on the Val instead of focusing on the others. So, because if she's down first, then no one else can be revived until she's up. You see, like right here, they're, they're starting to destroy my camera, but I have the shield, so now they can't do anything about it. I'm also still there using the, the lights and everything to get my uh, 
energy back. <coughs> See, now my shield is off, but I can still put a, a detail here so that she cannot do the objective for some time. Again, spawning uh, infected zombies. You see, I got my shield already. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna save that. I'm just gonna control him for a little bit here, the, the zombie, so I can get her off the objective. If she's there. Get get them infected by hitting them here. And uh, you see, now I'm gonna go away, go to the camera, and destroy. So I have the shield here because we're recovering. I still have time enough to shoot her off the. Uh, Objective, which is where the, uh, the passive dispenser comes into play, where they take like 10 seconds, I believe, if you're using the passive, but the security that increases the time for the security devices to be completed and also the uh, bio health, the, the core health at the zone 3 of the bio cores. You see, right there, I use the shield again, so they, can, they cannot do anything here. They're, like, they're just stuck there. I'm spawning zombies on top of them, infected as well, which means like they're gonna get infected and stay there. And also have the machine gun to keep like, constantly shooting them as well as the mobilizing rounds. Which is also just eating their time away, not, not just downing them. Um, right here I got also got another liquor. The discount just makes also everything cheaper, so it is so good. As well as the creature booster card. And I also have there my uh, my mod, my mod recycler, so if I need more energy at any point I can just use that. Or if I want to just get more cards, he, he destroyed the camera for me. So if I go back, I'll have the shield. So I, I actually, in this case, I'm actually timing. Uh, like I'm timing when he destroys my camera to when I go back to it, because that way it's a way for me getting the shield when I need it, without actually using my card, you know, for the shield. And you see, like they just so much they have to do with now. They, they just can't do this objective because I'm constantly getting the shield on the camera and just spawning. Like creatures and everything you know, inside of that room, and uh, yeah, just like that they, uh, they lose. Uh, the best thing they could have done there is the same thing I was doing, which is time. They should time the when they are destroying my camera. But if they ha if I have the shoot, there's nothing they can do. But still, their best bet was to like time the camera. Like they destroy the camera immediately when I'm about to interrupt her. Cause that way, by the time I get back, I recover the camera. She's, she will be already finished. She would have already finished the objective on the security device there. Um, so guys, that's the uh, match two for the. Uh, you can see the power when you use the shield on the deck for the infinite energy build.